Hey everyone and welcome back to another Let's Take a Look at video and today we're taking a look at a game called Gato Roboto. Um, and uh, this is a, it, it, it's an action, adventure, Metro, uh, Metroidvania kind of game uh, where you're playing as cats, I think in like various robot suits and you're, you're fighting enemies and exploring different areas and it's cool and it's fun. Um, and uh, would like to note you know, beforehand, I did purchase this myself. Lately, I've been playing a lot of games in these kinds of videos that I got keys for. I did buy this myself, so sorry, I hit my mic. But, uh, you know, just wanted to clarify that. Also, um, I was going to say something else. I had it mapped out in my head. I don't remember. Let's just get... Oh, I remember. Wanted to mention that I haven't played this yet. And I've kind of been making an effort to play some of these games that I've been starting lately. But this one, I figured it was pretty self-explanatory uh, what it was about. So I kind of just went in. Gary to mission control. Come in, mission control. Over. Mission control here. Over. Commander, I'm getting a signal from a small planet on my patrol route. Coordinates 42... Oh, uh, yeah. 42069. Over. Those coordinates correspond to one of our research facilities. Likely a false alarm, Lieutenant. This particular facility has been long since abandoned. Over. Permission to investigate, sir. Over. Approach with caution, Lieutenant. Over. Affirmative, Commander. Approaching target, sir. Preparing for... Yo, Gary, we have lost visual. We are going down. Hold on, kitty. Damn cats. See, this is why you can't get a cat. Got to get a dog so that they can shit all over your floor and make your life miserable. Ugh. Can't move. But I'm alive. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Meow? Huh? Kiki, my kitty. I have bad news, Kiki. I am trapped inside this ship. Kiki, you will have to go in my place. Meow. Am I really talking to a cat right now? Sorry, kitty. I'm up for a promotion. And I can't afford another mishap. These research facilities generally have a pilotable security mech available. Let's see if we can find one. I will help guide you using your radio collar. Just make sure to listen for my voice. Godspeed. Meow. Good kitty. Aw. Alright. It is arrow keys. I also, I you know, I tried going into the options menu and changing the controls. And I could not. Um, but I mean, this control scheme isn't terrible. What do you want me to do with this? Is there anything I can do to this thing? It looks like a giant button. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, escape. Take me back. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I'm assuming that's the wrong way then. Boing, boing. Whoa. Ooh, okay. Gotcha. We can climb walls. Uh. Oh, it's water. Is something wrong, Kiki? Kiki, don't tell me you're scared of a little water. Meow. It's the only way forward, Kiki. You have to get in there, Kiki, one way or another. Okay, we're in the water now. Okay. Um. See... Looks like a giant button. That's all I'm saying. I want to press it, but I guess it's nothing. You know, if we can't do anything with it. It doesn't appear that I have any other controls. Other than what I'm doing right now, anyway. But I'm sure we'll get there eventually. Great work, Kiki. 
step onto that platform to suit up. Hell yeah. There we go. Look at you, Kiki. Somehow it fits. Press up when you want to get out. Now that you are equipped, it's time to figure out what happened here. Yeah. Good kitty. Okay. How do I shoot? Okay. Maybe it's C then. Wait! I don't know how to shoot! Wait! I wasn't told... I wasn't told how to... Ah! 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 Wait, stop! I'm not ready! Oh, there we go. Okay. I figured it out. We're fine. Don't worry about it. I wasn't worried. Yeah, there you go. This control, uh, this control scheme is a little odd, but... You know, I, 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 I can get down with it. It's, uh, you're using the left and right arrow keys, Z to jump and X to shoot. It's a little bizarre, but, uh, you know, it's not terrible. Hey, where did all these come from? We just traveled through here. God. I'm killing all these animals. These look like perfectly good am uh, animals. I don't want to hurt them. Even though they may try and hurt me. Can I shoot this? I can! I knew it. I'm a genius. Okay, well, I can't do anything about it, but... Ah, shit! Maybe I could play this with a controller? I'm going to plug in one and try here in a second. Get myself to a safe vantage point. And then let's plug in my controller. Don't bug out on me, please. Give me this pop-up window like, mm, Microsoft doesn't work. Ooh, I can't play with a controller. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, this is so much better. Oh. I will take playing with a controller in these kinds of games over playing with a, a, uh, a what's it called, a mouse and keyboard. Yeah, that's the thing that I have. Shit! Wait, I can't climb on the, on the walls anymore. Are there some scenarios where I'm going to have to leave my, my suit behind and then I get it back? I don't know. Hell, these just respawned. I guess that's a thing that happens now. Okay, well, I don't want to leave this behind. Damn it. Okay. Uh. Shit. There we go. Huh. There we go. Um. We're all back this way, I imagine. And there was a portal all the way back here. That I saw. Oh! They freaked me out. There we go. There we go, and we can actually get through here now. Ooh. What do we have here? Oh, it restored my HP. Look at that. Thank you. Very much appreciate it. Okay, well, I can't get through there. Yeah, you know, I thought that guy said he was gonna, you know, Gary, I thought he said he was gonna be guiding me. Doesn't really seem like he's doing a whole lot of guiding. Seems like it's a lot of me you know, happen to explore over here, which I am not a fan of. Well, you know, I am a fan of, but guided exploration is what I like the most, believe it or not. Okay. Oh, shit. 
It's a battle room. That's okay. I am far too good to ever die. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, well... That was, uh... Okay, so these are... Those also serve as, uh... As checkpoints. Fair enough. Which way did I go? This way? I think it was this way. Fuck. That was my bad. Damn it, I, like, I can't jump on top of him and kill him. That kind of sucks. I'm used to that from... from Hell is Other Demons, because I've been playing that a lot lately. Uh, there we go. Alright, I mean, we're going into this fight with little to no HP. No, no, no. Stop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come here. There we go. There we go. Hell yeah. Okay, eject. What do we got down here? Oh, it's all underwater and it's a maze? Except I can't go up. Oh, I have to jump. I forgot. Go, 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 go. Before you drown. I don't know if that's a thing in this game, but I don't want it to happen if it is. Go, 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 go. There we go. Uh, imagine we go... Oh, I didn't realize I could climb these. Fuck. There we go. Wondering what all this is for, but I guess we'll find out, huh? Oh, okay. So we're kind of... Oh, this is new. What do we have here? Kiki got a rocket module. Dude, hell yeah. You got a rocket! Press B to use it. Demolish bricks. Amplify your jump. Over and out. Thank you. Give me it. Hell yeah. Yes. Yes. This is glorious. I imagine we can overheat it, like use it too much. So, try and take it easy on that. Uh. Oh. Okay, but how do I use it to propel? Because, uh, you know, Gary did mention that. I don't really know how to do it, though. Uh... Oh, I see. Well, that makes it easier, then. Totally didn't realize that I could actually blow those up. Hey! No! Bad. Bad. Bad! There we go. Went the wrong way. Get out of here. Get out of here. There we go. Eh. Eh. There we go. Come here. Come here. Come here. Down here, buddy. Alright, that's fine. Okay, go through here. Well, this is where we were before, so this was just for us to, to get through. Okay, gotcha. Hey, thank you. Meow? The hell is that? Oh, it's a mouse! 
What's that squealing noise? Kiki, I am getting a bad feeling about this. Oh, okay, you know, it's a super mech. Um, mouse. Okay. Love those. Those are my favorite. Don't know about you, but I uh, can't get enough of my super mech ma uh, mice. Ow. Where do I have to hit him? I don't know where exactly, like, the proper place is to hit him. Can I skip this? I know. Because I was dealing damage to him before. I guess I have to jump and hit him. Fair enough. Ow! Ow! Cut that out. God damn. It's like a uh, next level Tom and Jerry or something. The hell, man. All right. Another shot here. We're beating this mouse, you know, one way or another. I like that much. I'm gonna tell you right now. Oh fuck! He does the same thing every time, you know. I, I, and I still get a, uh, I get baited. Now because like I'm super aggressive and I'm like, oh, I can do it. Obviously, I cannot. Wow, that was. Uh, <laughs> okay. Don't get baited. Oh, you got baited. Don't get baited. You got baited. Oh, man. God damn it. Holy shit. I, I, dude, how? How on earth are you supposed to do this? Maybe you can shoot those, uh, those, uh, those things he's shooting at you. I have a feeling that you can, and that I'm using the rockets for the wrong thing here. Okay, you can't. You cannot. I was wrong. You just got to be better about dodging them. I don't know how you want me to do that, C considering that they can just, you know, bounce off the wall like that. But, uh... Fuck. What the hell? What's happening? What's happening? Stop. Ah, no! <laughs> oh, God. This is, uh, this is hard, man. This is like our first boss fight. I am, uh, I am really struggling here. Dude, I mean, this is, uh, this is some difficult stuff. It may not look as difficult, as, uh, but, you know, it's actually extremely difficult. Maybe instead of trying to shoot him with rockets, I should try and shoot him regularly. Because, uh, might be focusing on the rockets a little bit too much. Okay, never mind. It's actually not any more effective. It's extremely ineffective. God damn it, dude. I fall for it every time. Well, I mean, really, it's just a matter of not knowing how to dodge it, you know? Like, you know. But... Damn, that time we uh, didn't take any damage. We're good. Don't do that. That's dumb. I need to not be so afraid to get close to him because he doesn't have any close range attacks. You know, he's not going to do anything. You get real close to him. Missed. Okay, get out of the way. There you go. We can afford to be careful, too, because he's not... 
he, uh, he isn't gonna... Like, you know, he's gonna do this attack. And then essentially we're gonna get free range to shoot him. Kind of. Okay. Starting to get the hang of this. I understand how his attacks work. A bit better. Wow. Yeah, that time I just jumped right into it. It's my own fault. No! Hey, there we go. Ouch. I mean, squeak. Meow. Uh, was that mouse speaking? It appears that I have lost a lot of blood. Keep moving forward, kitty. I am counting on you. Okay. Well. You know, frankly, I'm just glad that we got through that, because that was, uh, that was truly hard. <laughs> that was, uh, harder than I was expecting it to be, honestly, but... I had to get a feel for, for what their attacks were like, you know. This is fun, though. I'm having a good time. Very, very fun and neat game so far. It definitely fits the mold of, like... Um... You know, neat, cute indie game. Even though it is published by Devolver Digital. Which, you know, I mean, like... It was obviously developed by a smaller indie company, but Devolver, they're like the, the, the kings of publishing these cute little indie games, you know, that uh, that everybody becomes uh, big fans of, you know. They love doing that. Not that there's anything wrong with doing that necessarily, but just saying, you know. It's not like this game is exactly struggling for people to play it. Or tr uh, struggling to get a player base. I mean, that's what I meant. God damn it. What the hell is wrong with me? Just... What's in here? Get away from me. There you go. Okay, I mean, there's something up there. I don't know how we get up there exactly. Um, yeah, it might be something for later. Honestly, let's head back. Don't you do it. You may think that I am needlessly killing a lot of these frogs, but they, you know, they are, they're doing it to themselves, honestly, by being so threatening and menacing. Uh, there we go. Come here. There we go. Alright, uh, okay, so this is where we were before, right? No, wait. I mean, was it? I mean, we, can we take a look at the map or something? Oops, no, 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 get back in there. Okay, that's the D-pad. Trying to figure out how to activate the map. Because I had a way of looking on the on the keyboard. I don't think I have a way of looking on controller. Hmm. Oh, uh, okay, there we go. Um So Yeah, we're back to where we were before. There are various checkpoints sprinkled throughout. 
I feel like we're on the right path, though, or we were. I'm going to go back through here. Hey, get away. Hey, there we go. You're offline. Yeah, I know. I'm well aware of the internet issues I've been having lately, okay? Don't need to be reminded right now while, while I'm playing a game that is a good time. Okay. The issue here, I guess, is I don't know how to get up. I don't know how to get up there. Other than, you know, ejecting, and then even then, I don't think I can get up there. Oh, I can, but, I, like, I can't shoot, you know. I'm pretty sure that unless we get some kind of upgrade, that's a dead end. But if I look at the map again, we're here. Ah, no, no, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know if that messed with the the recording. Let me check. Um, okay. It, it, it's still locked on here, but uh, I don't know what you guys saw. I mean, really, it would have just been my Steam library and, you know, my, my video manager page, but god damn it. I wasn't expecting it to do that. Okay. Um, so I'm going to head this way. Like to the right and then down and then to the right again. I don't think we've been this way either. Maybe we have though. I don't know. How do I get up there? I mean, I can't, you know, unless I go as a cat. Um, I mean, I would have to go all the way back. I would have to go all the way back this way. God damn it. Stop it! Let's fuck off. Alright, uh... I'd have to go back all the way this way. I mean, like, I can't even get through there. Okay. So I'm gonna go back this way, then. Because it kind of seems like it's leading me in that direction. Even if, you know, that's totally inaccurate. Um, and I, uh, I'm aware of the time. Like, you know, how long we've been going for. Um... But I think we can go for a little bit longer here. Wouldn't hurt anybody. Wouldn't hurt me. I'm having a good time with this game too, so. Come on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it some time. Yeah. Alright, so we went through here. Remember all of this. We're gonna we're gonna keep going all the way to the left. And then we're uh Yeah, we're going to go back this way. Yeah, now we can go down here. Which is pretty freaking neat. Where are we? Oh, okay, we can go this way. Ooh, what's this? Oops. Oh, I see. What's this? Security faculty log number 2312. This is Jimbo reporting. Jimbo, doctor has gone mad. The security systems have been modified to target all personnel in the compound. Most of my colleagues have either been killed or turned into one of those things. I am fleeing via one of the surface level escape pods. And though I am unsure I'll survive the trip back, my heart will always belong to the shores of Earth 2. Over and out. Okay. Alright, so that's what that was. Alright, so we kind of got some insight into the lure of, uh, of the game. 
don't have any problem with that. Uh, okay, so we have multiple different paths we can go here. I think I'm going to save that for a later video because I do want to give this game at least one more video, if not more. Um, I want to give it a, a little bit of time and see, you know, like what what more it has to offer really because we did spend a lot of time just i mean really learning the the controls and getting familiar with them and kind of getting used to them and it appears that this game has a lot more to offer than that so i do want to give it a little bit more of a look at in some future uh in some future videos here so we'll probably do a little mini series on it um you know i'll try and sprinkle it in here and there um but I do want to want to play more of it. I want to get a better feel for it because I had a good time playing through this. You know, it's it's a neat little indie game that, yeah, I mean, you know, even though it's published by Devolver Digital and granted, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm just saying that they, you know, like I was I was saying before, they publish a lot of these, you know, neat little indie games. And, uh, you know, it's good for the developers um, that they get this kind of attention because they're, you know, getting published by their games are getting published by Devolver Digital. But anyway, um, you know, I, 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 I did want to, uh, did just want to say, you know, or offer my quick thoughts rather uh, on the game. And uh, it's good. I mean, it's a good time. The music is fun. Um, well, not fun, but it's, uh, it's good. The soundtrack is good. Um, the gameplay is fun. The game doesn't really seem to take itself too seriously with its own story, which I can appreciate. Um, you know, it's not meant to really be taken all of that seriously. You're playing as a cat, for God's sake. Um, but it's fun. You know, it's a it's a good time, and I am kind of invested in in the uh, in the story as well, even though it is um, a bit lighthearted. You know, or meant to be a bit lighthearted and not taken as seriously, um, which. Uh, which is good, and I can appreciate, um, you know, the writing in that way. Um, so overall, you know, I've been having a good time. I like the graphics, I like the art style, of course. Um, it's a good time. It's a, I mean, it's a good time all around. I don't really have anything to complain about other than uh, the, the keyboard uh, control scheme, but it's a personal preference thing, you know. I like a very set keyboard control scheme for like platformers and whatnot because you know i'm a nerd like that so um it, it like you know i don't know if i had the ability to change the key bindings that would have been pretty cool but that's a you, you know it's like it's a subjectivity thing it's not really something that can uh, that i think should hold too much weight against the game at all because it's personal preference at the end of the day and it didn't even inhibit my enjoyment of the game that much at all. You know, it was just like a, a very minor, minor thing that I wish I had control over. But, you know, it's whatever. Um, you know, I mean, aside from that, though, very enjoyable. Uh, and I'm looking forward to playing more of it as well. Um, because I definitely think it's worth more attention. And, you know, worth diving into, a, you know, at the very least, a little bit more Um so we can get a really get a feel of like what this game is going for. Um, so anyway, with all of that being said, if you guys enjoyed this, uh, let's take a look at a video of Gato Robato. Uh, let me know down in, the, uh, down in the comment section below. Like the video and share it with your friends. Let me know you do you uh, you want to see more of these. Let's take a look at videos that I do here on the channel. Um, the link down to the game is in the description box below. If you want to pick it up for yourself, it is available on Steam. And I believe that since it is the the first week of release still, um, there is a like a 10% discount or something uh, on the game. So it's available for like seven bucks, I think, which is dirt cheap for what you're getting here. Um, so I would definitely recommend picking it up uh, and giving it a look for yourself because I'm sure I'm missing stuff already. Um, or not understanding some things that could have helped me along the way or something of that sort. So I definitely recommend giving it a look for yourself as well. And uh, subscribe to my channel for more gaming content. I play all sorts of games on my channel. Thank you guys very much for tuning in. And I will speak to you later.